Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a wave with dupliverts. Really cool effect. It's really easy, so before I get started, please rate and comment, subscribe to my page, add me as a friend, all that stuff. Keep watching my videos. Check out my channel for more tutorials and cool videos. Okay, and that's it. Let's get started. So, first thing you want to do is you want to keep your cube, just size it down a little bit, and add a plane. Size the plane up. Go in the edit mode tab, W to bring up specials, and subdivide it. That's good. Now, press the Q and then shift click the plane and press Ctrl P. Oops, I, I forgot to press Ctrl. Ctrl P, make parent. And what that does is the Q becomes a child and plane becomes a parent. But what that means is that the child can go around by itself, the child object. But the parent object has to move the child object to it. Okay, now press the plane. You go to the this tab right here. Press dupliverts. And you can see it got really thick. Now if you press the cube in the middle, size it down, you can see that the plane copies the cubes on every vertice that it has so don't subdivide too many times and bring it to a good size when we render the plane will not be visible anymore so it doesn't matter what color it is I'm gonna color the cubes red Oops. let's press the original cube in the middle I'm going to make it a little more reflective and a little more special. Okay, that's good. Now we want to add a wave. So click the plane. You can check what you have clicked right here. Add modifier and wave. And if you press Alt A to play the animation, it does that. But it doesn't look too good. So if you want to change that, just go to speed. And I'll put it at 0.075. Look at it now. Looks pretty good, but it's a little bit too high. So I'm gonna put the height to 0.41, and that's perfect. So let's just stop it at a good frame. Right there is good. I'm gonna set the settings like I do. You don't need any of these turned on. Okay. Well, and that looks good. I'm gonna position the camera a little bit better. It's gliding. So go into textured mode really fast. Just press Alt V. And one more time. And that looks pretty good, but we can make it look better. So press the camera. And to make it look better, I'm going to give it a black background by just going into the world setting, putting this black. Press stars to give it some stars. The more stars you want, just change the star distance. 15 is good for me. And I'm going to give it a glow effect. Space to add. Scene. Scene. Add glow. Put it right above it. Go to this tab here and turn the boost factor all the way up. Got a little more glow there. Turn the threshold down and turn the blur distance all the way up. And it looks pretty good. Turn the threshold up for less glow. And uh, that's all there is to it. I'm going to render this and play it at the end, which is now. And thanks for watching my tutorials. And keep watching. Check out my channel for more cool videos. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.